Our primary product is the Bowhead Reach, which is a three-wheeled adaptive mountain bike. And it's for anyone who doesn't have the ability to ride a mountain bike. When the first person got the bike, he asked me, how does it fly? And I'm like, it doesn't fly. And the next day he sent me a photo and he's like four feet in the air. And then it was like everyone who got the bike three days later on Instagram, they're like at some sort of altitude in the air. Bowhead Corp is an engineering company really specializing in adaptive equipment for people with disabilities to get outside. I broke my back in 1996. From the moment I broke my back, I very quickly realized that I was going to be 100% reliant on technology to get around. I was a machinist, I was doing my apprenticeship, so I had an understanding of mechanics and how to build things. And so it wasn't a stretch to be able to see that future that I could actually have some power in this situation as far as building my way through problems. And that was always designed to be for me. You know, selfishly, I was making these things so that I could get outside and I could do these things. This little girl named Lindsay, who had a type of uh, cerebral palsy, had heard about this crazy guy and this crazy bike, and she wanted to use that crazy bike to go on the Andy Peak Challenge. There's a disabled kids camp. Able-bodied people would go hike up the mountain and fundraise. We get to the base of the mountain and we tie a rope to the front of it so that Lindsay can have like four or five of her friends tied to it like dog sled style and pull her. You know, cut to me and her mom sitting at the bottom of the mountain waiting for her. Lindsay and her crew come around the corner. He says, Mom, that was the best day of my life. And that's when I was like, oh, this is where I need to put my time. And I need to make sure that this design that I've been making for me needs to be for everybody. That was sort of the moment where, where Bowhead started. Every individual who has our bike really teaches us what it's for. Like a downhill mountain bike is typically for someone who wants to go downhill mountain biking. Whereas our bike can be for an elderly person who wants to hang out with their grandkids or someone in their mid twenties that had a, a border collie when they broke their back and now they can finally get back and like run with this dog. Or we've got Jack. So Jack's out there like jumping it and he has heroes that are super cool on his bike, on his exact bike. Or the person, frankly, like me, who's a little older now, and I've got my kids and I'm riding them to school on my lap or I'm towing like the neighborhood kids to school on the trailer. And they get questioned by their friends at school, like, what was that thing? And they pull up Instagram and they get to show it. And so, frankly, for me, the fact that my son can reference really cool material as to why his dad's different, it makes me feel good. It makes me feel confident that when I drop him off at the schoolyard, kids aren't like, oh, Ollie's dad's in a wheelchair. It's like, no, like, did you see Ollie's dad's bike? That thing's crazy. Did you see what people are doing on Instagram on it? You know, like, it has been a really cool tool. My message to people that maybe are newly injured or have been injured for a while or just haven't gone back to the places they love is to just go back. And only then will you learn what you need to, to get better at. Go out and do something, be confident, and it'll pay off always.